Hi guys, how's it going? I decided to come up with a series called Who's Your Future Partner? As most of you know, tarot cards can uh, give us hints what kind of people are going to be coming into our lives in the future. They can describe their looks, they can describe their intentions, their personality, job they do on a daily basis, and just, you know, any little details. So I've never done this before. This is strictly for fun, and I'm not claiming that it's going to be 100% accurate and it's gonna resonate with anyone. However, I am doing this for fun. So if it does resonate, you know, give me a thumbs up and uh, yeah, let's see how it goes. Hey Cancer, this reading is for you. Uh, let's ask the cards what kind of person you might meet in November. Uh, you might already have met them, or you might already be talking to them, or it might not resonate with you at all. So let's see. Okay, this person has some kind of a physical job or just a lot of responsibilities at their job. They deal with a lot of communications, uh, a lot of people, they're constantly uh, talking to clients or something like that. There's like a lot of communication, a lot of action going on in their life. They could have been through something in their life that like some kind of revelation that completely changed their uh, mindset. It's either a winner or somebody that loves attention. Somebody that might have haters. Uh, they could have. They could be either blonde, or just really um, caring. You know, I think they are blonde. No, they're caring. They're super caring. <laughs> and blonde, possibly. It's a person that works a lot, really hardworking. Somebody that's very flirty. Somebody that has a lot of friends and likes to go out. Could be a Sagittarius or somebody that's very, very patient with everything they do. Uh, very balanced inside. Yeah, very balanced. Could be a little bit of a stalker or just somebody that's very sharp and truthful. Sometimes a little bit of a dick however you know they do speak their truth could be an air sign this is somebody that moved away from something uh that was upsetting them in the past somebody overly emotional however they bring you joy somebody that either likes to drink or honestly they are very like independent they they're happy with whatever they have right now, they don't really need any more. They had some kind of loss either in their family or in their love life in the past. Could be a cancer or somebody that travels a lot for work or just, you know, travels a lot, loves to travel. Somebody that's really good at manifesting, somebody that believes that they can manifest and teach others how to do it. Could be an air sign or somebody like a government worker, employee. Very cold from the outside. However, you know, this is just the outside. Mm. Could have had some money issues in the past. Or health issues. Somebody that doesn't really sleep much because of their job, their work, you know, they're always busy. Somebody that lives somewhere else, uh, could be overseas, could be in a different town from you, uh, not in the same, uh, possibly not in the same town as you. Somebody very wealthy. All right, guys, well, this is it. And let me see what letters could possibly be in their first, last, or middle name. H-E I got here. C H S D or P. That's it, guys. Um, hope you liked it. Bye bye.